Assalamu alaikum everyone this is Muhammad Hamza from fun with tips today this video tutorial is about nested if structures in conditional structures an if statement within an if statement is called nested if statement in nested structure the controls enter into the inner if only when the outer condition is true only one block of statement are executed and the remaining blocks are skipped automatically the user can use as many if statement inside another if statement as required. The increase in the level of nesting increase the complexity of nested if statement. Here we have the syntax of nested if structures. The outer if the outer block shows the outer if statement in which the inner block inner if statement is written if this outer this is the keyword if and condition is written into these two br small brackets if this condition comes true the inner if will execute the control enters into this if statement if this condition comes true this statement will execute it otherwise by default this statement will be executed but if this condition comes false the outer if condition comes false it will it will directly by default execute the else statement written over here now let us move towards how if work if nested if structure works the flowchart in nested if statement the condition of outer if is evaluated first if it is true the the control enters into the inner if block if the condition is false the inner the inner if is skipped and the control directly move towards else part of outer if if outer if is true then control enters into the inner if statement and the inner if evaluate according to the simple if statement the flow chart shows that if when the program executed and the controls enter into this condition if this condition comes true it will direct straight come into this condition after then it will be simply evaluated as one only once if statement then this condition will be checked if this condition comes true it will directly execute the statement written in if statement but if this condition comes false it will by default execute the state else statement but if this outer if statement comes false it will directly execute the else statement by default which is written in the outer if statement that's how the nested if structure works now let us move towards compiler here we have the program write a program that inputs three number and display the smallest number using nested if conditions so first of all we have to declare three variables because we have to store three numbers in three very vari different variables one one number in one one different variables int a b c here we declared three variables now input these variables to store three numbers enter three numbers scene a b and c this is another type of input statement that we can input more than one variable after writing this operator and the variable name now using nested if structure the first one condition the conditions will be such like that a is less than b a is less than c a is less than or b is less than a and b is less than c and c is less than a c is less, less than b such like that the first condition will be a is less than b if the condition comes true a is less than b and here we have to use nested if structures so we will use another if statement in this if this condition comes true a is less than b then the another condition that a will be less than c a is less than c now c out if this condition comes true so we have to write that a is if a is less than b this condition comes true it will enters into this condition if a is less than c if this condition also comes true 
so it will directly print out that a is less than a is the smallest number smaller number but if it this condition comes true and after this the if condition this a is not less than c this condition comes false then it will directly execute the else statement in which we have to write uh, print out that c is less than c is the smallest number c is the smallest number smaller number now this nested structure ends now the we have to complete this if structure so we will here write else statement in which we will again use nested structure so if condition here comes the condition if b is less than c then we have to print out b is the smallest number now if this condition comes false the other condition by default else will be executed in which we will print out c is the smallest number that is the whole now compile that is the whole program here it will display how much errors and warnings zero error zero warning run enter three numbers 5 4 and 9 5 3 and 9 3 is the smallest number program correctly correctly executed this is all about now we let us move towards the flow chart of this program how to understand if the which condition comes to the program will enter into which conditions so actually how the above program works the above program inputs three numbers and find the smallest one here follow the cursor please here we input three numbers a b and c when the control enters into the outer box the first condition the first if condition a is less than b is evaluated if the if it is true the control enters into the smaller box the smaller if condition in with a nested if condition if a is less than c is evaluated if it is also true the value a is display it will result or print a that it is a is smaller otherwise it will the value c will be displayed that c is smaller and then the program will direct terminate if the first condition a is less than b here a is less than b is evaluated and it is false the control shift to the else part if st of if statement here is the else part of if statement now the condition if b is less than c is evaluated if it is true the value b will be print out and the whole program will terminate otherwise the c will be print out and it will terminate so this is the flow chart of the above program uh he we can also print uh, we can also do this program by using other by using logical operators and not on or uh, which will be discussed in our next video tutorial so that was all for today please must subscribe our channel fun with tips thank you guys see you at the next video